I'm gonna be taking orange soda from out of the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lavish Palette. And I'm just gonna take that on like a little fluffy brush and I'm just gonna put it in the crease. My Violet Voss Holy Grail Palette, I'm going to take, are you kidding me? On a BH Cosmetics brush. Going back into my lavish palette, I'm going to take Sienna and then put it directly in my crease. And I'm also going to take it all the way to my, oops, I'm going to take it to my inner corner. Um, I want this to look to kind of look like a sunset in a sense, so it's going to have that little. together I'm just gonna take a fluffy brush um this is a BH cosmetics 101 brush and I'm just going to blend everything together this doesn't have any product on it so. and then on that same eye crease brush I'm gonna go back into the holy grail palette and I'm gonna take wine and dine and then just intensify up that crease so. A cranberry splash on a BH number nine brush. I'm just gonna get some of that and pack it on my lid. And since I'm going for that sunset kind of look, you have to have the sun in there somewhere. So I'm gonna be using my ColourPop Get Lucky Super Shock Shadow. I'm just gonna take it on my BH 102 brush. And I'm just going to pat it in the center of my eyelid. Like that. And I'm going to go back in the brush that I used to apply Cranberry Splash with. And I'm just going to pat around it so it can blend in. I'm going to take cream from out of the Lavish Palette. And then just put it under my brow. I love this color. And I'm just gonna highlight my brow bone and Laura Geller Gilded Honey. And then just place it on the high point of my brow bone. Ooh, I love me some gold. And now I'm going to put on my falsies. I'm going to use my Kiss Lashes in Peony. I'm gonna take my Black Radiance 2 Complexion Primer, my dog Rover, and then after I put my, I already have my primer on, so now I'm just gonna go in with my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Max, my favorite, favorite, favorite foundation right now for the summertime. my Maybelline Master Conceal Concealer. This is my new favorite concealer. This reminds me of Max, um, I think it's a Max Pro Longwear Concealer. This is like the exact same thing, just so much cheaper. So if you're into the Max Pro Longwear and you wanna be on a budget, I would definitely say go and get this and try it out.
take my beauty blender. I'm gonna take the concealer on the up on the side of my nose. And just to make sure everything blends in, I'm just going to take my Real Techniques sponge all over again. And I'm just going to blend in my concealer some more. Just around the edges so I don't have any harsh lines. See, do you see that natural contour already? I didn't even have to use um, powders or concealers or anything. Now I'm going to move on to baking. I'm going to take my Ben Nye Banana Powder on my Beauty Blender. I'm just going to tap that in there just a little bit. And I'm going to set my concealer. My Real Techniques contour brush. I'm going to be using um, my BH Cosmetics contour palette. I'm going to take this reddish brown shade mixed with this darker brown shade. And then I'm going to do my fishy face. And then right from where my air is, I'm just going to bring it down just like this. take it around my hairline or well, just gonna like dab it and then whatever is left on the brush I'm just gonna take it down my nose take my black radiance um, pressed powder in the color bronze glow on BH Cosmetic number three, and then I'm just going to buff this line. Don't forget to do it around your forehead. My Real Techniques brush and just pat. Now I'm going to be taking my MAC Studio Fix in NC45. Ooh, it's on my brush. On my MAC Duo Fiber Brush. And just set my entire face with this stuff. I'm going to go back onto my eye. I'm going to take Are You Kidding Me? On this BH Cosmetic Brush I have underneath here. Just because my eyes are really, really sensitive, this brush is super, super soft. I'm just gonna take the Cranberry Splash color on this 212 brush, and then I'm gonna place that exactly where my lashes are, but underneath them, not on top. <laughs> Get Lucky Eyeshadow. And I'm just gonna put this on my inner corners. So I'm gonna use my the bomb the Mary Luminizer highlighter. I'm gonna use that first, but I broke it, so it's like all messed up in the Ziploc bag. Don't judge me. Look at that. Ooh. Now, going in with my second highlighter, I'm going to be using the Laura Geller Gilded Honey. And I'm going to be taking my blush. It's um, MAC, is it Breezy? Yeah, MAC Breezy. 
And I'm just gonna place this in between my highlighter and my contour. I'm just gonna take it back. Okay, moving on to the lips, I'm gonna be using um, Jordana Lip Liner in Tawny. It's gonna line my lips. I really like Jordana's lip liners. They're so creamy and really easy to work with. And they're cheap, duh. And then I'm just gonna go over Tawny with my Kat Von D Lolita. Dab some of this on. I'm slick with suede and vintage. I love lip concoction. To finish it off, I'm just gonna use my Max. My Max. <laughs> I just created a new brand. I mean, my NYX Matte Setting Spray. 